and you have to serve them in turn. Water, drinks, anything you want. There are plenty of other Water up on the go for the resources. Here. If you turn the if you if you don't pay the water bill, what is it? The baby gonna be small and and, and, and breast. Time gonna be cold, what they do? They turn it up. God said that's your enemy. That no normal man. You understand? Well, Come on. Ain't it nakedness? Nakedness. The target clothes. What do you make from? Look in the target clothes, brother. Look in the target clothes. God said they're gonna serve your enemies in want of all things. Instead of in anger and in thirst and in nakedness. Look in the target clothes, brother. Look at it. Taiwan, Joppa. All these places. These people are the enemies. The Chinese are the enemies. The Arabs are the enemies. You understand that point? And in want of all things, God said, anything you want. You want to eat, you push your breath. You understand? You want to waste. You want to tie the fifth to wipe your butt. Everything. You want to drive a drive. Mark something. Anything. That's not the thing. Everything you want, you have to go to him. God said, he's your enemies. Come on. And he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck. Him. Him, his forefather, him, the same spirit in him. That what they did. Bastard, that what they did. You put yokes of iron up on our neck. But listen good. And he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. So when you destroyed, he can say to you, my brother. No, he's not your brother. You he's your enemy. Do you understand that? He's not your brother. The Chinaman is not your brother. Right. The Arab man is not your brother. Right. The African is not your brother. Right. The East Indian is not your brother. Right. The Japanese is not your brother. That's right. You understand? You're supposed to be one of these people. Look, look at the sun. You're supposed to come from one of these tribes to say that's your brother. You understand? All are one in Christ, Galatians 3.28. There's either Greek or Jew, bond or free woman. Give me Romans 9. All are one in Christ. That's what I want. For him. Read mine 6. Read Romans 9. Give me Romans 9. Yeah. And you ain't gonna tell me what to read. Give me. You ain't gonna tell me what to read. Come on. Because you don't want to tell the truth. What is the truth? The truth is. What is the truth? God Tell him the truth. Say God loves all the world. God so loved the world when? that he said the world. When God loves the whole world. Huh? From the beginning. Yes. Look at chapter 22. Give me the beginning. Genesis, Let me go. Verse 18. Give me the the yeah, whole brother. world. You're going to see that God don't love everybody. Listen to this. That's Abraham. what he tells you. That's what he teaches you. World. That's what they teach us in slavery. Brother. John 3 16. God loves everybody. That's a lie. Yes. But listen good. Second answer. Chapter listen good. Don't God. listen to him. Listen to what God said. Stop listening to the so called white man. We've been listening to him too long. That's 400 years. And nothing good come from this man. We're still in captivity, brother. Working paycheck to paycheck. And come with you trying to deceive you, Samuel. Listen, it's good. Listen to God. Don't listen to him. Come on. Listen. Second answer. He said God loved everybody. No. Hey. Why? Why he take this out? Why he take this out from the Bible? Ask him why he fought for the from the Bible. Ask him. Why are you fall for take it from the Bible, the Greek captivity? Because it's not Because like why you take this from the Bible? Because you don't want to see our, our brothers and sisters come on this no, side. Because where, where, where is that at in your message? Come on, give me that. The give me that. The We're going to read the beginning for you to show you that God do not like it. Come on. Second Ezra, chapter 6. Just listen to what God said. Don't listen to him. God is a deceiver. He's a devil. What the Bible speaks about. Come on. And verse 54. Verse 54, come on. And after this. Adam also. And after these, Adam also. We're talking about the first man, right? Adam we're talking about. After these, Adam also. Whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures. Adam named all the creatures upon the face of the earth. That's why you know that a pigeon is a pigeon. You know the dove is a dove. You understand? You know that that is a cedar tree. That is a what? Breadfruit tree? That you know that that's a bread. Adam do that. Not him. Now he's trying to profess himself like God. He fly to the moon my friend, anytime he want. My friend, he it. He's no God. Right Listen, it's good. Come on. Of him That's come we all. Of him come we all. All of us, all of him come from Adam too. But listen, it's good. Come on. And the people also who thou hast chosen. God have a set of people who God chose. So the people who God chosen. Everybody come from Adam, but God have a race of people who he chose, right? Come on. All this have I spoken before thee. Oh Lord, but listen good, God speaking about it in front of all of the Israelites. You understand how we still break our commandments. But listen, it's good, come on. Because thou made the world for our sake. If it wasn't 
we in here. You understand? Know, God made a word for me and you, sir. That's they right. Have, they was here to serve That's me and you. But because we break laws, God said I'm gonna make a certain enemy in one of our things. Come on. As for the other people. As for the other people. The people who choose them, put them one side, right? And now I'm talking about the other people, the race of people. Come on. Which also come of Adam. These people also came from Adam. Come on. Thou hast said, you God. As well speaking, said, you God. You said that they are nothing. They are nothing. Not because they see them building. Not because they see them running the hotel. No. God said, they are nothing. Come on. But be like God. You ever speak yet that some spittle right from the side? God said they are like that. Every last drop one of them. The Chinese, the Arabs man, the, the Japanese, all of these men like that. That's what God said. But listen good. You're gonna see white man in the Bible. You're gonna see Chinese in the Bible. You're gonna see Japanese. You have to know their biblical name. Then you know that what he's talking about John 3 16 is garbage. You understand? So when you read in the Bible, you see Mohawk. It's the Chinese. God comes to the mom as it's washed back. As it's washed back. That's why you see them love to do nails. You ever see all Chinese love to do nails? That's their character. Do you understand? When you see them, is a so-called African. What they like to do? They like to put their head in curl back and all these things. You see them, right? Beating open on them. That's why God said, one of all the kingdom of the face on the earth, he said, to the basic of all things. Egypt shall see be the basic of all kingdom of the face on the earth. Do you understand? That's what I said. You have to know these men, biblical name. When you know the biblical name, no. you have John 316 or No. Now, if God was talking to Nicodemus in verse 1, how will it read John 316? He's talking about everybody. He was talking to Nicodemus, the ruler of the Jews. You understand? So, if all the Jews are going to speak to the Jews, right? But, so now when you read the John 316, God so loved the world, I'm going to prove that to you. Give me John 316. Because that's what he used now to feel like said he want to say you are his brother. No, he can't be brother. God said I for the other people, they are nothing. You are something. You are the most special and more genuine people whatever what the face of the world and always be. That's right. All right. So you you only have to keep God last brother and him go back into captivity. You don't have to leave a stone. You don't have to leave a gun. You don't have to leave no bomb, brother. Just keep God laws and all of these who are a nation in captivity, brother. That's the key. That's the key. You know, That's what they don't want me to start a key. Come on. No, you ain't gonna finish nothing. Keep yourself over there. Go and teach your people. You're garbage. You don't Come on. Hear the so, chapter 3 and verse 16. We're gonna break them John 3 16. I know why you open your book too. We're gonna read them, break them John 3 16. John 3 16. We're gonna break it down for him. John 3 16. Come here, sister. Listen, John 3 16. Start right here. I like that. I like that. Now God said, my sheep hear my voice. That's why God give the so-called white man that knowledge to build computers. You understand? To build internet. Because that's how the world's gonna reach the Israelites. Do you understand? So now you're talking about John 3 16 that God loves everybody. We are here to break on John 3 16 for you. And tell you that God only sent Paul as a minister. Not the Israelites, which is you. You are Israel. God loves you and love all nations upon the face of the earth. We're gonna prove it right now. John 3 16, come on. John chapter 3, verse 16. John 3 16, that's what this man wanna say. God love everybody. Go and break it up. Come on. But God so loved the world. We want to know who God is for. Read Jonah. Give me that. Luke 1. Read for God. Who is God is for? Read Luke 1 16. You remember, we're breaking down John 2 16. Right? He said for God. We want to know who God is for first. Come on. Luke chapter 1 verse 68. Bless be the Lord God of Israel. So now you know that your God is only for the Israelites. He said, Bless be the Lord God of Israel. Go back, John 3 16. For God, John chapter 3 verse 16. For God so loved the world. So now, for God so loved, we want to know who God loved. Give me Isaiah 11 verse 1. We want to know who God loved. To me you understand? No, Romans 9. You know that, Romans, yeah, 9, Romans 9, verse 13. Romans 9, 13. We're going to dispose of him. Romans 
Because you say God loves everybody, right? Exposed. That's what he just said, right? Cherry picking. Cherry picking. My man, talk to me. Look, look, look at me. Don't look at him. He said God loves everybody, right? We're going to prove it in the Bible that God loves and God hates. Come on. Romans chapter 9, verse 13. Uh -huh. As it is written. As it is written. So we're going to give it to you. We're going to tell him our word. Come on. Jacob, have I loved? Jacob is a part of these 12 boys. And all praise is you in it. Jacob, have I loved? Come on. But Esau. But Esau. Esau is the father of the Caucasian race. Esau the white man, the so-called white man. He's not white. Was Esau, God said, but Esau. Esau have I hated? But Esau have I hated. You see that? God do not that John 3, 16 alone kill him. God so loved the world. That's garbage. That's garbage. Shut up, cool. Come on. That's not speaking the truth in love. John 3, 16. You don't even know how to speak. John, chapter Jesus 3, verse 16. Speak we hope we're here speaking God's words. Come on. For God, so God, God, God so loved the world. For God so loved the world. No. We want to know which world God loved. You understand? That's how we break down John 3, 16. You won't listen to me because you don't have the answer. Because you, you is nothing to me, man. You are is nothing to me. You is nothing to me. Why should I answer to nothing? Why should I answer to nothing? You should answer to him. And his word is Remember, God so loved the world. We're going to prove to you who God loved. Come on. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord. With an everlasting salvation. Nobody, nobody can run this race. But the Israelite. With an everlasting salvation. You hear me? Come on. He shall not be ashamed nor confirmed. We should not be ashamed no more. Do know that we are the greatest people on the face of the earth. That's and if we right. king, we should do keep God laws. He is not king. Come on. So here you world see. without end. What? World without end. end. The Israelite world is going to be without end. That's the world that John 216. What are you talking about? God so loved the world. His world is going to be without end. You understand, man? Come on, read again. Isaiah chapter 45. Verse 17. Listen good. Listen good, people. Listen good. God only loved the Israelites. Look here what you want to feel. Look here what you take it. God only loved the Israelites. Come on. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord with the everlasting salvation. He shall not be ashamed nor confounded. World without end. World without end. We have a world without end. His world gonna end. Because they're going to show you. Because remember, if God going to destroy everybody, right, up on the face of the earth, who's going to build up Jerusalem for a thousand years? Israel can't build Israel. We must have slaves. I want to ask you. Build America, America. I want to ask you. We black and Hispanic build America, right? So now, I when, you when one Jerusalem more should build in a thousand years, you understand, right? One more question. Who's going to build it? All nations, all other nations going to build it. We're going to beat them sun up to sun down. Isaiah 14 verse 1. The Bible says in the book yeah, of 1 Timothy 1 and verse 10. Also, I want to show you this book real quick. This is called uh, Classical Biblical Baby Names, okay? By Judith Trophy. Now, when you read in this book, it tells you, she gives you definitions of certain names in the Bible. So it says, uh, this is Esau, because we said earlier that Esau and Edom is the so-called white man. Everybody, the white race is Esau. Look at this, it says, according to the commentaries of Hebrew scripture, look, I want you to look at it too. It says, according to the commentaries of Hebrew scripture, Esau is considered a significant right. character in world history right there and the forefather of the Roman stage, Empire. Who was the Roman Empire? Caucasians, Greeks, Greek or Rome, Greece and Rome are who? White people today. That's what they are. So go back to Romans 5.13. Romans 9.13. Romans chapter 9 and verse 13. As it is written. Because the brother was pointed out in John 3.16 that said God loved the world. If God loved everybody, why does the Bible say this? Read. Romans chapter 9 verse 13. As it is written, Jacob have I loved. Jacob is the father of the 12 tribes. Those who are 12 tribes like this, that's Jacob. Read on. But Esau have I hated. But the Esau, who's Esau? Look at it again. Esau is the Roman Empire. Who is the Roman Empire today? White people. Read on. Read that again. As it is written, Jacob have I loved. Who's saying this? God is saying this. 
Jesus. Jacob has he loved. Read on. But Esau have I hated. But he hates Esau. Who's Esau? The white man. That's what the Bible say. We didn't make that up. That's what the Bible say. That's right. You understand that? You understand that? That's why they don't never go to their own neighborhood and preach garbage. They come to the black neighborhood. That's right. They don't go to Garden City. They don't go to Valley Stream. They don't go to Levittown. That's right. They come to the black neighborhood to preach garbage. That always. That's why. You understand that? But God says He loves you. God said He loves you, and He loves you too. But you gotta stop being in that madness. You should be flying to men and cease your from boys and crossing the rest of the world. Listen, 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 listen. That's the problem. When you see us as Israelites, right? Stand up here. Stand up in the street and ask teacher, man. He can't we are going to put up enough on the struggle. You understand? If you come and you ask me a question, I'm going to give you the same the Lord. I'm going to speak my word no more. Our word do not help us, brother. When we do our own thing, God do not work with us. You understand? When Moses, right? You still lead Israelite. How we taught Israelite? He taught Israelite how you be like? I'm going to show you how Moses taught Israelite. Give me that Hebrews 9, verse 19. Let me talk to you how Moses deal with Israelite and we was what? We was together. We was in one. You understand? We was a, we was what? A nation. Look at this good. Hebrews 9, 19. Hebrews chapter 9. Let me show you Moses start the people. That's why they don't want us to start the Israelites like that. Because they know they're in trouble. Come on. But when Moses had spoken every precept. When Moses speak to the children of Israel by precept. That's all the Bible. You're going to understand the Bible. They don't want us to tell the Israelites. Thus say the Lord as our God said we must start. You understand? Come on. To all the people. To all the people. Come on. According to the law. According to the laws. Yeah, he was talking about all the people, but God gave the laws. Who the laws was given to? It is right. We get the laws. That's why we have an advantage over him. Give me the Romans 3. You know what I want. Because listen, it's good. We have an edge over all nations. You so-called black. You Hispanic and you native. We are above all nations. That's right. You understand, brother? That's what you understand. We are on the side for 390 something years. Servant slave. This is wake up time. This is wake up time. They don't want you to wake up. They want you to still sleep. Come on, you crazy. Read this for him. Romans chapter 3 and verse 1. What advantage that have the Jew? What advantage we as Israelites have of over all the nation? Look at it. God said, what advantage you black, you Hispanic have over the white, the African, the East Indian? You understand? You, you Chinese, are you Japanese, are you Arabs? God said, what advantage the Israelites have over these nations? Listen, good. Or what profit is there of circumcision? You must circumcise a boy eight days when he born from his mom. You understand? They don't want to do that in the hospital no more to these boy kids when they're born. As long as he's an Israelite, they don't want to circumcise you. Or when they pull growing like this, they, they still won't, don't want to circumcise you. You have to use religion tactics to get that circumcision. Look at it! Come on! Much every way! Circumcision, God said when you circumcise, we have an edge of them. Much every way! Circumcise! You must circumcise that big man. That's what God said. Come on! Chiefly! Chiefly, that means mainly! Come on! Because that unto them were committed the oracles of God. The Israelites get the oracle of God. This is the Bible. God give the Bible to the Israelites. Was written by the Israelites. God, right. the Israelites, was issue to the Israelites. That's right. Play no games. With Bring it out, Caucasian man. Come on, you with the garbage, you lies. Bring We're gonna out. teach all people. Thus say the Lord. That's, That's right, right, sir. Shalom, Israel. I'm Elder Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets up. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC. 
to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, please make sure you subscribe to this join IUIC channel to get your latest updates on all our YouTube channels. Shalom.